to my channel my name is Irish Castle um, if you haven't subscribed to my YouTube channel I do fashion beauty travel haul lifestyle recipe cooking and a lot more and for today's video as you can see in the title of the video it's my Black Friday 2020 haul and if you are curious please keep on Black watching. Friday is um, November 27 yes November 27 but the reason why it was um, it was delayed because I haven't received all my boxes. Actually, I still have two more boxes to be shipped to me, and I don't know when is the estimated arrival on those um, boxes. I think I'm just gonna make a separate video out of it. But anyway, um, these are all my Black Friday haul. Um, some of them I purchased online. Some of them I purchased it on the store. So the first thing is I'm gonna go through what I purchased in the store. Um, every year here in United States, we have this tradition called Black Friday. I normally go on that one sometimes, not only sometimes, every year. Okay, let me rephrase that one. Every year I, go, I always buy something out from Black Friday or the Cyber Monday sale. It's always been like that because it's for Christmas. Um, most of the stuff is on sale. They have like lowest prices ever. So the first one is we went to Marshall. And what I got in Marshall is not that many. The first thing I saw here in my bag is from Marshall. Is this toy for my dog and it's only $3.99. I got my dog a Christmas present too of a collar and lead set for her. And um, I got my husband a Michael Kors um, pajama set and it looks like this here in the back. I don't want to open it because I mean like, you know, this is good for like Christmas present already. It's all I'm going to do is wrap this one. And it cost me $24.99 for a, a pair of pajama set. The next one is we went to Macy's. Macy's has a lot of sale going on and um, he, I kid you not, they have all the sale that you can think of. Actually, I went to Macy's twice that day. So the first bag is I got this um, t-shirt for my son. It's the champion t-shirt. And this is originally $25 and I only purchased this for 12 bucks. So it's 50% off. And then the next one I got in Macy's is another Levi's t-shirt for my son. He's wearing medium now for men's, not kids, men's, and he's only 13. Um, this is $24.50 and I got this for $11. So that's all I got for Macy's because I went back there and changed everything. Um, I got this um, set of masks also from DTNY and this is only cost me um, $14 and it has a lot of um, decoration on it. I mean, I don't know. I think I'm going to send it to the Philippines. And then the next one is still in Macy's. I went to get a champion t-shirt for my husband. It's just a plain red t-shirt and there's a logo, a logo, 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 logo in here. Um, this is only $20, but then they put it on sale for 10 bucks. So like 500 pesos. And then the next one is I got this Levi's again for my husband. Um, for reference, this is um, large. I'm going to link all, I'm going to put it in the description down below. You know, the sizes and the prices also, if I forgot to mention it. Um, this is $24 and I think I paid $12 for this one. And then I got this pajama set. So every year, you know, like Macy's, Kohl's, all those a big department store, they always come up with a pajama set. And this one is originally... $59.50 and we only spent uh, $19 for this one. So this is very good per Christmas present. It's already wrapped for you. There's a bow in here and then you can put here from and to. There's already a card here. So this is ready to be put underneath the Christmas tree. So this is for my daughter and she's wearing size medium. No, small. Extra small. And then the last one is I got myself another Levi's um, small t-shirt. Um, 
I told you, I think I mentioned that many times, that every time I go home, you know, most of my stuff, you know, left, will be left behind because my nieces and my nephews will ask for me or even my sister. So this time I bought again another pair of t-shirt for myself because I love graphic tees and I, I, I live with t-shirt all the time. Um, so this one, I paid $10 for this one and originally it's $24.50. No, actually $12 because it's 50% off. So this is what it looks like. That's all I got for my first trip in Macy's and then I went to Kohl's and Kohl's has a sale for Nike shoes. I bought three pairs of Nike shoes for, from Kohl's and these shoes only cost me $29 during Black Friday sale. So I'm going to show you the first one. The first one is a it's a you know a typical running shoes and it has you know orange embroidery here it looks very nice um, it has a lot of cushion in here too and this one is size 9 and I paid $29 for this one and it looks like this together uh, so it looks like this looks like that for $29 the second pair that I got is this another one it's for my son it's um it's a dark navy blue um, it's the same thing. It has a Nike logo here and it's size 9. This is for my son. He's wearing size 9 now. <coughs> I told you I just woke up. And it looks like <laughs> this struggle is real. It looks like this. It looks like that. So this is $29. So how much is $29 um, in the Philippines? I believe it's almost like 1500 pesos. It, I'm gonna go give you guys a calculation how much is $29 and then the last one is this is for my son also it's a green because green is his favorite color it's a little um, it's not green it's neon green and and has a black on it it's just a typical running shoes and it looks like this underneath it it has a lot of um, I don't know what is it called it likes um, I can't remember what is it called you know like it puts a lot of grip especially when it's raining so that you won't slip or this is good for like basketball when you're playing basketball because you know you, you won't slip on this kind of shoes so this one is for like typically running shoes I think I just said that one running shoes then and then after that one we went to Walmart me and my daughter went to Walmart that day too and um, we bought some um, Christmas present why did she tie this I don't know she bought a Christmas present for her friends and the first one that we got is these, the gift of relaxation. So it has a bath crystal, body butter, and then a shower gel. And believe it or not, this is only $5. This set is $4.99. And then she bought another piece of like um, body bath, um, shimmer bath bomb. You put it in your bathtub and then it would like explode there in the bathtub with all the bubbles so this is $4.99 also and then after that one we most of my purchase is from the website so the first one is I went to amazon.com and I bought this um, a headset for my son he plays computer all the time he plays Nintendo all the time he has Xbox Nintendo all these games that you could think of he has this one so he always he has this we purchased this um, nice um, um air what's it called airpiece headset and then this one is in amazon it's supposed to be 89 dollars, but then they put it and sell for 39 dollars. it's a do um, the deal of the day at that time and i'm gonna link it down below to you know this specific um headset if i can find it and then the next one is i just received this box from adidas yesterday and um i bought a pair of shoes for my husband and for me so the first one I got is so last birthday that I have I have this pair of um, white shirt Adidas and then this time I got the black one and then this one is originally $30 this one was on sale for $18 in adidas.com so I always buy my most of my shirts in adidas in adidas.com because um, you know I, I don't know it's, it's more cheaper and then I got another pair of shoes for my husband and it's a blue running shoes and this one is originally what is the original price of this one 
There's no, but it looks like this. It is originally, let me look at my invoice, because I have an invoice somewhere here. Well, they didn't send me an invoice. I think this is $45, originally $100 something dollars. So this was like 50% off also. And then the next one is another pair of Adidas Stan Smith because I collect Stan Smith. I don't know how many Stan Smith I have, but I collect them over the years. And this is an 8.5, the same thing. I think I paid $35 or $40 for this one. This is like 50% off because Stan Smith is what, $90, $120? So it looks like this, you know, just the typical Stan Smith. And then the, there's a decoration or some kind of like embroidery in the back. Um, they look like this. It looks really nice. I can't wait to wear them. Yeah, I don't know how many Stan Smith. I just collect them. I love it. The, the way that it fits my, my feet and the way that, you know, it works in your... Um, in your outfit it works perfectly that's why i like stan smith than the um, adidas original i have those short shoes also and i don't normally wear them the last one the last box that i received yesterday was from vance so my daughter she collects vance shoes also i don't know how many pairs of Vans shoes she have i think she has this is her fifth or six vans i don't know she has a lot of vans also not a lot but she collects them she likes them so the first one is this it's a vans shoes and um she already had this pair of shoes before but then this one has embroidery so she said it's different she's just like me so it looks like this and this um this is originally um okay hold on $60 don't quote me on that one but we paid $39.99 for this one because it was on sale for Black Friday so that the, that's the first pair and then the second pair is the same thing it's the same Vans and it's the slip you know the one that you tied on so this is um, a tie-dye shoes from Vans also I don't find this appealing, this pair, this kind of shoes, but then she likes it because, you know, teenagers. And then the last one that we got her is this hoodie from Vance. Now, this hoodie is, oh my God, it's $39 just for this hoodie. And look at that. It's just a simple hoodie with, you know, the signature Vance um, logo. And I believe the original price on this one is $59.50, but we paid $39 for this one. I know it's quite a long video, and I hope you guys like it. Um, this is all that I got for Black Friday, and leave me a comment down below if you, you, know, if you shop in Black Friday also. Um, thank you so much, guys, for watching, and have a good day. Bye-bye.